Wait is finally over this morning. Hundreds of people will meet at Quinnipiac University for the Denise DeCenzo Foundation's Walk to Fight Rare Diseases. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Olivia Schuler joins us now live from campus with everything you need to know. And a little rain is not going to stop us, right, Olivia? Roger, it's not, but I have a lot of questions. I heard you say you're not for the umbrella and you like your hair wet, and I don't think you are in the majority with that. I think a lot of people are going to count on one of these today. Just a little bit of rain coming down in Hamden right now. It is rain or shine. Everything's going to kick off at 9 o'clock. There will be carnival games inside for the kiddos while registration is happening. And then at 10 o'clock, that two-mile walk around beautiful Quinnipiac campus will get started, and it will be led by pipes and drums. And as you know, this is the second annual fundraising walk for our beloved news anchor, Denise DeCenzo, who passed away in 2019. She was Connecticut's longest serving news anchor and a part of Channel 3 for 33 years. Community organizations always had a piece of Denise's heart over the course of her career. And today, people will walk in her memory while giving back in a big way. Part of the proceeds will go to the National Organization for Rare Disorders. The organization's mission is to identify, treat, and cure rare disorders. Now, this is an event you are going to want to bring your entire family to. As I said, rain or shine, Denise's family will be here today, as well as Lieutenant Governor Susan Beitzewitz and Senator Richard Blumenthal. We are live in Hamden this morning. Olivia Schuler, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Olivia. And the umbrella definitely works for you, by the way. All right.